Okay, so on my wings I have these uh, just standard 9 gram uh, servos. There. This wing was totally ready, I just had to install the servos. And I'm going to use. Uh, I'm not going to use a Y harness, I'm going to use two server extensions. I'm going to uh, set up flapper arms on my radio. And over here, 9 gram servers didn't fit there. And I didn't want to expand the hole, so I'm using the recommended 7.5 gram servos from E Flight. Right there. I haven't screwed them in yet. But I will. Now I'm going to set up my radio. Tail is 100% ready. There. So, set up my AR6200 receiver right now. I'm using my AR6200 receiver. I'm going to put the wire through this. And over here, over there, on the wall, I'm going to install the satellite. My DX6i spectrum transmitter. It's going to be model 3 MUS Mini Ultra Stick. I have my uh, bind plug here, so it's ready to plug. Um, so I'm working on the radio and server installation right now. I'm going to bind it and I'm going to, I removed the arms, servo arms. I want them to be in neutral position when I install them. Receiver is bound and I have the servo arms in their neutral position. Now I'm just going to use the uh, tiny little screws to secure the server arms and then I'm going to insert them in those slots and screw them in and I'm done with um, rudder, rudder and elevator server installation. Then I still have to come over here I still have to install the push rods for both server and elevator. These are um, connectors for the push, push rods and they came with the plain hardware kit it has uh, all the hardware needed so these are going to be installed right there on the server arms just like that right there just like that oh, let me see uh, this camera can go very close so there it is Let's see, up, down, up, down. I need to reverse. Wait, that's, yeah. That's right, uh, elevator needs to be reversed. Let's see now. Up, down, up, down, perfect. This Velcro is to secure the battery. It needs to go right there. See? And then there. There. 
right now, Jamie is going to hem the leg. Okay, I have one the other one server connected to the auxiliary one port and the other one connect to the aileron port Do you guys want to watch Skate okay. to Africa? So set my flapper ons now First of all, I'm going to go to set up Guys, I'm watching Skate to Africa oh. And I'm going to go to Me, Alex Me, Alex Wing tail mix. In great metal bird. And there you go. Du dual ailerons. Active. There, active. Everything else inactive. There. We offer only happiness and good greetings. Is she gasping about a plane crash? Yeah, we just yeah. I thought. Sorry. You mean you came from off the reserve? Yeah, wait. I think that's it for now. I can make adjustments and reverse and stuff. Okay. Aeron's complete. The only thing I had to do was install it. It came pre everything 100% pre hinged. All right, I have three prop size, size, 12 by 6, 10 by 7, 11 by 7, so which one should I use? Let's see the number. So that this this is the outside. The number is on the outside, okay? Eleven by seven, sticking out. No, it's perfect. Right, left, right. So because I don't have a Y harness, uh, I'm using two separate ports for my ailerons, ailerons. When I reverse, I have to reverse the aileron port and the flap port. See that? So I went into flaps, my flap set up, and I went into land. And I have flap, 50%. I don't know, I'm going to be playing with this to see what works better with this plane. So now, when I flip, flip this, flap, watch, watch, see? So I'm going to be playing with this. I know she's not scared, but isn't she a beauty? My childhood was a nightmare. I spent the rest of my life trying to board up that haunted house. Guys, this is important. I really need I've heard people say that. She's my lady. <laughs> <laughs>